Buenos Aires is a city that is rich in culture, art, and history. The city is home to many museums and cultural institutions that showcase the country's unique identity and heritage. From art museums to theaters, Buenos Aires has something for everyone. In this article, we will explore some of the most notable museums and cultural institutions in Buenos Aires, including the Malba, Teatro Colón, and more. The Museo de Arte Latinoamericano de Buenos Aires, Malba, is one of the city's premier art museums, showcasing contemporary Latin American art. The museum's collection includes works by some of the region's most famous artists, such as Frida Kahlo, Diego Rivera, and Joaquin Torres Garcia. The building itself is a work of art, with its modernist design and stunning glass facade. Another must-visit institution is the Teatro Colón, one of the most famous opera houses in the world. Built in 1908, the theater is renowned for its stunning acoustics and ornate interior. Visitors can take guided tours of the building to learn about its history and see behind the scenes. For those interested in Argentine history, the Museo Histórico Nacional is an excellent choice. The museum is housed in a beautiful 18th-century mansion and features exhibits that cover the country's history from pre-Columbian times to the present day. The museum's collection includes artifacts from the Mayan and Inca civilizations, as well as items related to the country's struggle for independence. Buenos Aires is also home to several museums dedicated to the life and work of famous Argentines. The Museo Evita is a museum dedicated to Eva Perón, the beloved First Lady of Argentina. The museum's exhibits showcase her life and legacy, including her work as a champion of women's rights. Another museum worth visiting is the Museo Exel Solar, which celebrates the life and work of the artist and philosopher Exel Solar. In addition to these museums, Buenos Aires has many other cultural institutions worth exploring. These include the Centro Cultural Kirchner, which is housed in a grand neoclassical building and hosts a variety of concerts, exhibitions, and performances, and the Fundación Proa, a contemporary art museum located in the trendy La Boca neighborhood. In conclusion, Buenos Aires is a city that is rich in culture and history, and its museums and cultural institutions offer visitors a window into the country's unique identity and heritage. Whether you are interested in art, history, or performance, there is something for everyone in Buenos Aires. Buenos Aires is a city with a deep appreciation for art and culture, and this is reflected in the numerous museums and cultural institutions that can be found throughout the city. One such institution is the Buenos Aires Museum of Latin American Art, Malba, which is dedicated to showcasing the works of Latin American artists from the 20th and 21st centuries. The museum's collection includes paintings, sculptures, photographs, and other forms of contemporary art. Another notable cultural institution in Buenos Aires is Teatro Colón, one of the world's most renowned opera houses. The theater was built in the early 1900s and has hosted performances by some of the most famous opera singers in history. Today, visitors can take guided tours of the theater and learn about its rich history and architecture. For those interested in the history and culture of Buenos Aires, the city has a number of excellent museums. The National Museum of History, located in the historic neighborhood of San Telmo, is dedicated to preserving the history of Argentina from pre-Columbian times to the present day. The Evita Museum, located in the upscale neighborhood of Palermo, is dedicated to the life and legacy of Eva Perón, one of Argentina's most beloved figures. Other notable museums in Buenos Aires include the Museum of Decorative Arts, which showcases a collection of decorative objects from the 17th to the 20th century, and the Museum of Contemporary Art of Buenos Aires, MACBA, which is dedicated to contemporary art from Argentina and around the world. In addition to museums and cultural institutions, Buenos Aires is also home to a vibrant street art scene. The city is filled with colorful murals and graffiti, many of which are located in the trendy neighborhood of Palermo. Visitors can take guided street art tours to learn more about the artists and their work, or simply wander the streets and discover the art on their own. Overall, Buenos Aires is a city that is rich in culture and history, with a wealth of museums and cultural institutions to explore. Whether you're interested in contemporary art, opera, or the history of Argentina, there is something for everyone to enjoy in this vibrant and dynamic city. Buenos Aires, the capital city of Argentina, is known for its stunning parks and outdoor spaces. 
From large, expansive parks to small, hidden gardens, the city offers a wealth of options for visitors and locals alike. In this article, we'll explore some of the best parks and outdoor spaces in Buenos Aires, including Palermo, Park Lazama, and more. Palermo is the largest park in Buenos Aires, spanning over 1,000 acres. It's divided into three sections, Palermo Chico, Palermo Viejo, and Palermo Hollywood. Each section has its own distinct character, with Palermo Chico featuring stately mansions and embassies, Palermo Viejo showcasing trendy restaurants and boutiques, and Palermo Hollywood being home to the city's television and film industry. Park Lazama, located in the historic San Telmo neighborhood, is another popular park in Buenos Aires. It's known for its large, open green spaces and iconic monument, the Monumento a Don Pedro de Mendoza. The park is also home to several outdoor markets and festivals throughout the year. Other notable outdoor spaces in Buenos Aires include the Ecological Reserve, a nature reserve located on the Rio de la Plata riverbank, and the Japanese Gardens, a peaceful oasis featuring a traditional Japanese garden, tea house, and koi pond. In addition to these large parks and gardens, Buenos Aires is also home to several smaller, lesser-known outdoor spaces. For example, the Carlos Thays Botanical Garden is a hidden gem located in the Palermo neighborhood. It's named after the French-Argentine landscape architect Carlos Thays, who designed many of the city's parks and gardens. Overall, Buenos Aires offers a diverse array of parks and outdoor spaces, each with its own unique character and charm. Whether you're looking for a peaceful place to relax, a scenic spot to take a walk, or a lively park to explore, Buenos Aires has something to offer everyone. In addition to the popular parks and outdoor spaces mentioned above, Buenos Aires also boasts many other green areas that are worth visiting. One of them is the Ecological Reserve, a natural area located on the banks of the Rio de la Plata. This reserve covers over 350 hectares and features a variety of ecosystems, including wetlands, forests, and grasslands. Visitors can enjoy hiking trails, birdwatching, and bike rides, as well as picnic areas and a visitor center with exhibitions on local flora and fauna. Another popular park is the Japanese Garden, which is considered one of the largest outside of Japan. This peaceful oasis features a traditional Japanese garden with a pond, bridges, and statues, as well as a bonsai collection and a tea house. Visitors can stroll through the garden, participate in tea ceremonies, and even take part in Japanese cultural events throughout the year. For those interested in history, the Parc de la Memoria is a must-visit. This park is dedicated to the victims of state terrorism during Argentina's dictatorship from 1976 to 1983. The park features a memorial wall with the names of the victims, a sculpture garden, and a visitor center with exhibitions on the history of the dictatorship and the human rights violations that occurred during that time. Other notable parks in Buenos Aires include the Reserva Ecologica Costanera Sur, the Paseo del Rosetal, and the Plaza de Mayo, which is not only a park but also the site of many important historical events and political demonstrations. Overall, Buenos Aires offers a wealth of parks and outdoor spaces for visitors to enjoy. Whether you're interested in nature, history, or just a peaceful place to relax, there is something for everyone in this vibrant city.